Out here, there's no sunrise, just a planet, alone, drifting through a starless void. No dawn, no shadows, only cold. We call them rogue exoplanets, worlds unbound, tossed from their birth stars and left to wander. Recent micro-lensing hunts in 2025 are catching whispers of these orphans, tiny fleeting bends of starlight that give them away. Each blink says, another one, maybe trillions across the galaxy. Imagine the ejection, a newborn system crowded with giants, gravity shoving and slingshotting until one world loses the game and is flung outward, past the frost line, past the light, into forever night. Wandering ghosts, frozen homes or barren tombs. No sun, life in ice caves. If a planet is big enough, its core can still burn with leftover heat. Cracks in the crust, pressure beneath miles of ice. Picture an ocean sealed in darkness, geothermal vents sighing warm minerals, microbes clinging to chemical sparks. Not photosynthesis, chemosynthesis. A slow, patient life, if it exists at all. I keep thinking about the sky from down there. No stars, no constellations to wish on. Only black ceiling, groans of moving ice, and the hush of water that's never seen light. We're running drift sims, mapping lonely trajectories, rendering abyssal oceans that might be real. Every model says the same quiet thing. There are so many places to be alone. Maybe some keep thin atmospheres, warmed by a faint blanket of hydrogen. Maybe some are iron hearts wrapped in eternal winter. A few might cradle warm caverns where the dark isn't empty at all. If a world can survive exile, could something learn to survive with it? Rogue Survivor Story? Share yours. Subscribe for Wanderers. And if you're drifting tonight, hold on. The galaxy is vast. Even in the dark, you are not the only traveler.